Hey, welcome back. In this video, I will show you how you can make viewers send text to speech messages with channel points. They simply choose the reward, type their message, and then once they send it, it will appear on your stream just like a text to speech donation, but with channel points, which is completely free for them and which adds some entertainment to your stream. I can't wait to start spamming your stream. Pop champ. If you're a streamer and you're looking for graphics for your stream, then this website is amazing. It's own.tv and when you go to overlays and then to complete packages, you can find a big amount of stream designs. They are all animated and when you click on them, you will go to their separate page and here they have a preview tool and this is amazing. I can click on scene transition. This will show you the transition. I can click on offline banner that will show you the offline screen. Same thing with animated talking banner. You you can preview everything that's inside of a pack and then decide if you want to buy it. My code TVN gives you 50% of the price, so if you're interested, the link is in my description on Top TV. Check them out. So the way this works is pretty simple. First, we're gonna make a channel point reward on Twitch, which people can claim. Then we will link that reward to an online tool and that tool will be sent to OBS Studio or Streamlabs OBS. Now, one thing, it's pretty important not to skip during this video. I don't like saying it because it comes across as if I just want you to watch my whole video. But if you skip one step during this process, things will not be linked correctly and they will not work. So the first thing to do is making a channel point reward like you see next to me so let's go to twitch so you go to your profile and then you go to creator dashboard then on the left you will see viewer rewards you click on that and then you go to channel points now if they are disabled right here you can enable them and then here you will see manage rewards and challenges right here you see custom rewards create a custom one so click on it and then just call it tts you can give it a description to explain people what this is because a lot of people won't know that this is possible so let's Let's just say with this you can send me a TTS message for free. Now you need to enable require viewer to enter text so let's enable it right here and then you need to give it a cost. Now viewers earn 220 points per hour on average and then subs earn even more so this is up to you how often you want people to be able to send you a message like this. You can make this something like 100 then everyone will be able to send two of them each hour. You can make this even lower but beware of spammers and trollers that will try to disrupt your stream and give you bad time. But don't worry too much about that because I will show you how you can skip donations after setting up everything. So we've done this. You can create an icon if you want. And then here on the bottom, you can configure the cooldown. So if you enable this, there are three different options. So this right here, if you make it 10 minutes, then there will be 10 minutes between each text to speech. So no matter how many viewers trigger text to speech messages, one will go through every 10 minutes. The second one is a maximum amount in a stream. If you make this 20, then after 20 text to speech messages have been triggered by no matter who it will stop and no other text to speech messages will come through until the next stream and then the last one right here this is the same as the previous one but per viewer if you make this five then every viewer will be able to trigger five of them and after that they won't be able to trigger more of them until the next stream and then on the right you can see an example of how it will look now we have tts two times so i think it's better to make this text to speech so then you have text to speech and then under that with this you can send me a tts message for free let's click on create and then you're done let's go to my channel let's click here on my name and then on the bottom right you will see that people can click on channel points and then right here text to speech for a hundred points they can click on it they can send a message click on enter and then it will be sent but right now nothing happens because we need to set up the online tool which is this one right here i will add the link to the description once you're on the page you just click on login with twitch and then i get logged in immediately because i've done this before you will need to authorize and then after that you can click on go to dashboard so this is the one we just made text to speech let's click on edit right here and then right now we can click on add feature then this is the feature we added let's click on select module and on text to speech now i quickly want to mention that i've had contact with the creator of this right now everything on the website is free and in the future some pre premium things will be added but I asked him if the text to speech reward with the normal voice which is Brian which is this one right here he told me that this one will always be free now I can't guarantee you anything I hope it's still free
free when you're watching this video and if he keeps his promise it will stay free now if you decide to upgrade or if it's still free when you're watching the video then right here when you click on here you can see a bunch of other text to speech voices and then you can just copy the name like this press ctrl c and then just paste it here and then you will have another voice now again this will probably be premium when you're watching the video so i'm just gonna use brian you can limit the amount of characters someone can add in a message you can change the volume and then here you can add band words as an example you can add the n-word here then add a space then add stupid for example so then once we've done this we can just close it what we've set up at this point is that people can claim the reward right here once they add their message and they send it it will be sent to this text-to-speech feature and it will be converted to speech now at that point the speech needs to be sent to obs or streamlabs obs and that's done through this url right here so you click on show alert url you need to copy this so let's select it right click copy and then you need to go to obs or streamlabs obs i'm gonna use obs since i'm recording with streamlabs so let's quickly create a new scene so you don't see my face twice let's click on the plus icon then go to browser let's call it tts click on ok and then right here this url you replace it with the one we just copied then you just click on ok it won't show anything on your stream it will stay empty i'll quickly show you what's happening right now before i explain the next thing so let's go to to my twitch right here and then let's redeem a new reward let's type this works click on enter you see it gets redeemed and then right now you will see this moving is being played in my headphones which are imported right here and because of that it's also going to the stream now if you're getting an obnoxious message then you probably want to be able to skip it right now this bot has a few commands right here now i've tested them and they don't really work right now i'm not sure if it still needs to be fixed or if it's gonna be added in the future so i'm gonna show you another way to mute it instead of skipping it so when you double click on your browser source you can enable control audio via obs so let's enable this let's click on ok and right now we have another source right here which is tts so this is the audio of the text to speech so now that it's a separate source we have a few options we can change the volume by just moving this down and up we can also just move it to zero once there's a message we want to mute but for that you need to leave your game you need to go to obs then change the slider we don't want to do that we can create a hotkey to mute this tts audio source you just go to the settings then you go to hotkeys right here and then you need to scroll down till you find the options for this audio source so here you see scene 2 and then here tts show and hide that's for this browser source that's not for the audio when we scroll further we will find tts right here and here you can choose to mute and unmute it you can just add a hotkey to it so you just click right here in this area then you click on a hotkey then you click on unmute you choose another hotkey and then you click on ok now let's test it again let's go back to twitch let's redeem a reward right here let's paste some text click on enter and then right now it's playing so right now if i click the mute button as you see right here the source will be muted i won't hear it the stream won't hear it you wait something like 30 to 45 seconds then you unmute it again and right now it's gone now there is one really important thing because this tts source is going to the stream right now but it isn't going to our headphones or to our pc audio so we need to go to the advanced audio properties and then we need to change the audio monitoring of the tts source right here now what you choose here depends on your audio setup as you see here i have my desktop audio so let's go to the audio settings real quick so as you see here desktop audio 2 is my default audio device and when i go to my audio settings of my pc you see that that's my headphone so my headphone audio is going to the stream now because of that if i go to the advanced audio settings of the tts source monitor only means that it's going to my headphones but not to my stream but because i'm importing my headphones in obs as you see right here and as i showed you in the audio settings that means that because the text to speech is going to my headphones because i selected monitoring right here it's also going to the stream because the stream is also hearing my headphones now if you are not importing your headphones in the audio settings here then you need to change the text 
connects to speech to monitor and output. That means that it will be sent to your headphones because you selected monitor and then it's also going to the stream because you select output. And now here you can see everything that goes into play. So let's type something right here as text to speech. Let's make it a lot so we have time to explain. Click on chat. So right now this TTS will make sound and it's also going to my headphones because I am monitoring it right here. But since the output is muted for the TTS source, only this source right here, the desktop sound that's making sound will go to the stream. So because of that, I hear my TTS and the stream also hears it. Now this tool has some other options. The creator is also working on adding more, but this video was about the TTS. So if you enjoyed the video, I would really appreciate it if you would like it. It helps a lot in the YouTube algorithm. And besides that, thank you so much for watching and I hope that I will see you in the next video. Have a nice day.